Okay guys, so it's midnight here and I'm still wide awake doing some coloring. But I have to show you this, okay? First of all, Mama and Mojo are hiding. They always do. But I'm going to try and do this without disturbing anybody. One. Two. Three over there by the door. That's a cat. The other two are dogs. Three. Four. And five. I counted wrong. One, two, three, four, five, six. Anyway, there's five dogs and the cat, Boomer, sleeping over by the door. So, it's midnight. Everybody here is sound asleep. But me! Yep, I'm still wide awake. Coloring. There's that one. She's watching me. This one. It's like, may you shut up so I can go to sleep, please? <laughs> anyway, just thought I'd check in. Bye. Good morning, everybody. So, um, with all the dogs over at uh, my house, all the cats have descended on me here. <laughs> There's Gizmo hanging out with me today. Gizmo usually doesn't hang out with me, but uh, I guess I'm okay now. So today, scraping. Scraping and more scraping. That's what I'm going to do. Hello, guys. So, I still haven't slept. It's afternoon on Tuesday. I think this is day five with no sleep. Um, yeah, trying to find Lola right now. We came outside to get some fresh air. I came out with all the, oh, there she is, laying right there. I just didn't see her, just couldn't see her. So anyway, I, um, sprinklers are coming on. Lola, run! Sprinklers are coming on! Um, anyway, so this is day five now. I haven't slept. I did speak with my doctor, and um, they want to try and not do medication right away. They want to try... Let's see if I can get a good angle here. My hair and everything's a mess. Sorry, guys. I got my little dealy bobbers on. Um, they want me to try and at 8 o'clock at night stop my coloring and, and stop doing things on my phone and, and stuff like that to try and make it so that I can relax my mind enough to go to sleep. Um, I don't know how that's going to work. <laughs> um, with me being here by myself, um, it's kind of hard to have the discipline to stop coloring. Um, with if someone was here to make sure that I didn't pick the coloring book back up, it would be different. So right now, I haven't colored since. The doctor called me, which was a little before noon, and I am trying to hang out outside here a little bit and just kind of walk a little bit around. Um, I just don't, I don't see that being a fix for the problem. I mean, Maybe long term, but the fact that I haven't slept in um, five days isn't 
um, me not coloring right now isn't going to help that. Um, I need to be able to sleep and I can't. And I don't know what to do about that. So I'm going to try not to color the rest of the day or the rest of the night and see what happens. Bet you I can't do it. <laughs> what a beautiful day it is. It's nice and cool. It's starting to actually feel like fall here. It means it's in the 70s. So very quiet. Birds aren't screaming. And it's time for me to start scraping. And uh, there's some spots here that I probably need to clean. It's, I couldn't get up with just the hose. I got a, a, a stiff broom. And I will try to wash these spots off. Too much water will puddle here, so I'll have to figure that out. Alright, so it's completely scraped now. It took uh, all the morning to do that. And just uh, all I did was to remove the stuff that was actually loose. And there was just areas where water had gotten underneath it, obviously. Um, I was going to try to start painting it today, but I still have to clean some spots. There's some spots that are just caked in dirt that I cannot get up. So I'm going to get a stiff brush and um, some vinegar. I'm going to get some vinegar because I don't want to have to deal with uh, soap. It should just dry up, and then I could just paint over it. Right now, I'm just going to sweep, and uh, I'm going to sweep it all into this corner and throw it all away, and then I'll vacuum up the remnants and go get the uh, um, the stiff brush and the vinegar. So guys, it's a little after five. I still have not slept, even though at noon when I spoke to my doctor's nurse and they told me, you know, gave me some suggestions, I put all my coloring stuff aside. Everything. I put it away. I mean, I even packed all of my books into the basket, except for the one book that I was working on something in. Um, so at noon I put everything aside. I went outside for a little while with the dogs and thought, okay, I'll sit over here in the sun and get some vitamin D. Wouldn't you know it? I get stung by a bee. Mm-hmm. Me. I get stung by a bee. I'm allergic to bees. I'm home alone. Luckily, it happened very, very quickly. I pulled the stinger out. I took Benadryl. I had some Benadryl topical. I was able to put some of that on it. And I iced it so it didn't swell. The area got a little red, but it didn't swell up or anything. So either I caught it quick enough or I... I'm no longer allergic to bees. I don't know. But then I saw a second one. So I'm like, uh, no more vitamin D out here for me until Kevin finds this bee's nest. Yeah, so honey, you got a bee's nest out here you need to find so I can sit outside and get some vitamin D. Yeah. But I'm going to go ahead and end it here for the night because I am going to go to sleep somehow tonight. I am going to go to sleep. I'm going to shut everything off and I'm just going to lay here with my eyes closed and I'm not going to get up no matter what. The house can catch on fire and burn down around me. I'm not getting up. <laughs> I'm going to sleep tonight. <laughs> Anyway, I have no idea, um, well, I know what Kevin's been up to. He's been working on the patio. Yeah. So, I am just relaxing here with, uh, 
all the animals and um, that's about it so I'm gonna say good night here hope you liked everything that you saw or at least a little something that you saw here today if you did please give us a great big thumbs up a like a share a comment all that happy crappy stuff and welcome to all the new subscribers if you leave a comment down below telling us that you're a new subscriber, you will get a shout out on Wednesday when we do our shout outs. So if you want to hear your name, leave a comment down below. I hit my dearly bobber. Um, leave a comment down below and we will make sure to give you a shout out. Uh, so if you uh, like everything you saw, I already said, said all this. Thumbs up, yada, yada, yada. And we'll see you all tomorrow. Hopefully I'll be a little less foggy and a little more rested and Angel had to get her little self in here to say hi to everybody and we got Lola over here looking at me and we got Thor over there looking at me yep and Freckles and Kenobi are in the kitchen waiting to be fed of course but it's not dinner time so Anyway, I ended this vlog a long time ago, so goodbye!